Hey guys, just want to go over a couple things here. Um, for those of you who have a classic VW Beetle, I want to show how real simple uh, a conversion is from an external regulated uh, alternator is to an internal regulated alternator. Okay, so right here you'll see it's a brand new alternator I put in, a uh, brand new pulley, um, and if you'll take a look right back here, you're going to see your main battery post here. Uh, a little bit further back here, it's hard to see, um, you, there is a your green wire, which will go to that post right there, which will lead into your uh, in, underneath your back seat. Uh, you'll have a red wire, and you'll also have uh, your main power wire there as well. I'm not sure if you can really see it, but there's also there's a post there, um, or a ground wire, brown wire, uh, attached to the alternator itself as well. So every 1974 Super Beetle that I've come across so far, seems like the alternators are very in certain ways. So I want to show you the original one here. Here is my original alternator and the original uh, connection. So here you have your red wire, your brown wire, and your green. This green wire goes to your regulator, which is right here. And you usually will find this. This is a Motorola one. Sometimes there's Bosch and other name brands. Uh, this happens to be in early 1974, so it's not uh, exactly reliable. And later in, 90, in 1974, they also actually changed to a different kind of uh, uh, external regulator. Anyways, as you'll see here, again we have our green wire, we have our red, and we have our brown wire. Brown primarily is your ground, your red wire, red wire is your power wire. There's your green, and your green will then cycle through to underneath your uh, seat again, and I'm going to show you where that hooks up. So again, your red wire, which is your main, goes with your main power wire, your brown wire will then be grounded on your new one, on your new alternator, and your green wire here will also go, uh, will be onto a post that's at the back here for an internal regulated alternator. I hope that makes sense. Hope I didn't go too fast. You can always send me an email uh, and I'll gladly answer any questions. So, again, just to show everybody again, here is your internally regulated your externally regulated regulator, uh, which you'll find underneath the back seat of your VW Super Beetle. Uh, here's a blue wire um, which comes out. Uh, it's been snipped out right here, as you can see. Uh, get a nice good view of it on your original connector. There's your blue wire. So let's go on over into the Super Beetle and we'll take a look in the back of that uh, uh, underneath the back seat there so you guys get good real view of what I had to go through to rewire everything. A little bit sloppy job, but you know, it all does the same anyway, so bear with